Today's model is called the white-faced mouse, designed by the American physicist Mr. Robert Lang. It's one of the rare models which is relatively easy. This is a mouse that's made with one-sided paper, which means it's colored on one side and white on the other side. For the demonstration, we'll use two-sided paper. Here goes. So to make the white faced mouse, you need to take a square piece of paper, ideally take it around 6 inches or more. It should be fairly thin paper. We start by making the diagonal which is joining the two opposite corners together like this. We fold and unfold. Now get two adjacent sides which means two sides which meet at a corner. Get them to meet at the central line like this. This is popularly called the kite fold. A lot of children call it the ice cream fold as well because of the ice cream cone that this folds into. Once the ice cream cone or the kite is made, turn the paper over. Get this flap to go backwards on the spine of the paper like this till this becomes an isosceles triangle like this. Turn it over again. Get these, this entire edge Divide this into two like this and get this edge to the central line like this and get this edge again to the central line like this. Now if you notice there is a line that can cross between these two points. It can join these two points. On that line see if you can make a crease like this so that this corner continues to touch this line over here like this. This way and this way. For those of you who are wondering what part of the mouse this is, let's fold on the spine, fold backwards on the spine of the mouse this way. Does it seem a little bit like a mouse? Not really. That's because these two have to be held together by this flap made here. This is the nose of the mouse like this. Now fold it at the back and you'll notice that the the functional utility of this flap is to hold these two panels together. We are almost done except that you need to fold this at an angle like this. And now since no mouse has an angular tail like this, take a pen and roll this tail together like this. And soon you are ready with the mouse. Here. here are two little mice looking at each other. The design is by an American physicist, the famous Robert Lang. It's called the white faced mouse because when you use it with one sided paper, the face of the mouse and the ears turn out to be white like this. For our demonstration, we'll be using one sided paper only. Here we go.